Hi, ho guys and gals, welcome back to the Den of Tools. If you like modular storage, pack out, and similar kind of systems, Tough Built just pushed all their chips in and it, it's a game changer. Yeah, you hear that, you're like, oh, I hear that all the time. Prove me wrong once you see the whole video and read the article on this because it's insane how hard they're pushing on this one. Now let's talk about what's, what's all coming out. We, there's three releases, maybe four here if you wanna talk about it. So we gotta talk about this. So. This is Tough Built. This is their new Stack Tech system. And oh my gosh, I've said so many times that companies need to do more at launch when they start launching these new systems. And I guess Tough Built heard me because they did. Here's what's coming out in October, right? It's launching right now ish. It's gonna, I don't think it's in stores yet. I couldn't find it online. I haven't been in any stores recently. I'm recovering from COVID, so try not to infect anybody. But here's what we got. Toolbox, large toolbox, rolling toolbox, compact toolbox, organizer toolbox, compact low profile organizer, tote and crate. Now, typically what we get with those systems is we get five of those. Like we get the rolling box, the mid toolbox, the, the top suitcase style tool, toolbox, the organizer toolbox, and then the milk crate kind of thing. But this is, <laughs> this is insane. So here's what we got. This is spring launch, all right? Now, some of this is carryover from what they're talking about now. And again, I'm going to put a link to Tool Guide's article down here. I'm not going to show you the whole thing because this is their deal. I'm just telling you that they got the score on this and teasing you with a little bit because it's so tasty. So the rolling toolbox here, that's your basic one that's coming out in October. The large toolbox, that's going to be your middle box. The toolbox, that's the suitcase style one. Then you got the tool crate the organizer and the compact toolbox and the tote down here. The, there we can see that there's the tote. That's all what's coming in in October. Now next spring, available spring of 2024, they're gonna add in the XL toolbox to that. Then they're gonna see that we got the low profile organizer, the compact low profile organizer. We got a three drawer box. Again, I say if it doesn't have drawers, it's not a toolbox system really. I, I, you gotta have the drawer systems as far as I'm concerned. And not just a three drawer system, that's nice. But I wanna see, uh, uh, so I wanna see shallow drawers and I wanna see a larger drawer as well. And they've got that here with the one drawer down here. Plus, they've got all these bag systems, and these all work with the same interlocking system. And I got to tell you, the system looks smooth, super smooth. Then you got the backpacks that clip in. We got the coolers. We got the compact coolers. We got the lunchbox coolers. We got a, a shelf system, and I've seen pics of the shelf system, not just in the shop, but in mobile uses as well, like van stuff like that. We got the mounting plate. We got the work surface. That's a wood or bamboo. Well, I guess bamboo is a type of wood. Uh, it depends. I guess it's more of a grass, isn't it? Anyway, it doesn't matter. Work surface there. Stackable bins, ice pack, drinkware, four-wheel cart. That's your typical. You get everything out. You stack it up. You can wheel it around the work site. Cargo carrier, that's a two inch receiver, goes on the back of your truck. So you can carry, if your truck's full, you can you can put the all your your, your uh, packed system here on the cargo carrier, be ready to go. Hand truck system there with long tool kind of carry. So what, shovel, who needs a shovel? But maybe you're carrying a broom, maybe you're carrying other stuff, maybe you're carrying, carrying uh, some poles for uh, fishing wire, stuff like that. Two in one convertible hand truck. Now there's more. There's at least one, if not two other, there, there's, there's a summer launch. Uh, I'm gonna tease. There's the summer, and that's all I'm gonna wait. Where to go? There it is. There's the summer set, and uh, I'm not gonna show you anything more than that. You're gonna have to go over there and check it out because I'll be honest. The summer, the summer launch, I think has the coolest items in it. And then there's a whole line of accessories and more bags and more stuff, and it all works with this great kind of interlocking system here. And if you can see, the, 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 each one of these boxes has like a shallow recess where it all just kind of sits down in there and automatically locks into it. And then you got the, at the bottom, you got this little push lock system on each one of these. I got to tell you, there's been so many times these companies have come out and they've launched what seems to be a tantalizing new box or box system, modular system. And then they just don't really go anywhere from there. You know, you've got the heart system. It's kind of stalled out. You've got the, the Harbor Freight, the Bauer system. Uh, which is the, the sister system to the Menards one. They're both kind of stalled out. We haven't seen anything more from them. Uh, they're, don't get me wrong. They're solid systems. They're solid boxes. But there's just not enough for somebody who's really serious about this kind of thing, much less professionals and stuff. Then we've got like the Husky. Huskies just completely abandoned their old system, came out with a new system. Looks great. But again, it's the depth is just not there. And heck, look at, um, look at Rigid. Rigid's got a great system. But Rigid is, 
it, again, it doesn't have the depth. It has more stuff than like like the Bauer and the Heart and stuff like that, but it's not that much more. Not even as much as we're seeing here with their launch, uh, you know, their launch plan there. Uh, the um, uh, who else? I, you know, I'm I'm huge in the Dewalt uh, system. I, I've got the well the T, the older T stack system. I love the T stack system. It's it's been around for years. It doesn't have all of this. The Craftsman versus stack system, which is the sister one, of course, it doesn't have this. The new I, the new Craftsman trade stack. I have it sitting in the corner over there. Fantastic system. I was super excited about it. I'm I'm sorry, Craftsman. I I, I would drop you. <laughs> in a hot second for this system oh my gosh this looks fantastic and yeah i i get it. i'm kind of gushing about this um i don't have any relationship with with tough build we've talked about their products before on the channel often what i've said about them is that they have some very unique uh designs they, they the designs often seem a little over the top uh but they are really innovative sometimes innovative to the point of a solution in search of a problem but like their modular, or not modular, but their their portable workbench right now is my top pick for portable workbenches. Uh, the the bag system where it can clip in on all these other different things that works also with this is really incredible. They make a lot of great stuff at really reasonable prices. You know, the their sawhorse system, fantastic. A lot of the stuff they do is great. I think this is just insane. This is a company that said basically, no, we're we're going to own this market. We're going to go toe to toe with the biggest guy on the block and we're going to punch him in the face and take his lunch money and that's what they're trying to do and my gosh if they deliver on this timeline they just might do it uh at the very least it's going to force milwaukee to be like oh we gotta we can't we can't stop innovating we got to keep going because these guys are coming for us and coming hard i honestly there's nobody else even the new flex system and i love the new flex system with the new garage style ones that are like the old old school ryobi that we never got here they only got in australia and and it kind of disappeared anyway i've gone on enough go check out the link down before down below see the guy the whole article over at tool guide and then before you do it though Write down what you would want in a system that you don't see already and then go and look and see what they've done and then come back and tell me whether they, they have it already in, in the plan. I'd, I'd love to see what you guys are looking for and what they, they're already planning for and compare those two. Anyway, that's all I got for you today. You all take care. God bless. And as always, shine on.